uh, welcome you today. This is a prayer put together. All I'm asking you to do is agree with me. And as I as we agree, we're going to seek our Heavenly Father, and I pray. Heavenly Father, we gather together, and we come in an agreement in the wonderful and powerful name of Jesus Christ. We're two or more gathered, fear be in the midst of us, and anything we agree upon and touching, you will surely do, God. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, there's no distance in the spirit, and we thank you for the person I'm praying for, desire our prayer to renew their mind, God, by your word, God. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, we repent that they may come in contact with your word, and yet we disrespectfully allow themselves to turn their attention into something else, God. Yes, we forgive them for every being distracted from your word of life and love. We bless you, Jesus. Your word changes lives. Your word contains the power to save. Your word contains the power to heal, to deliver and transform and make all things new. We bless you, God. In this moment, the person I'm praying for is now giving your word complete reign in their life. Hallelujah. We bless you, God, and help them, Holy Spirit, to complete this theme. The word of God is in importance and regard it as reverential respect in Jesus' mighty name. When your word is preached, they will focus on a message and renew their mind to your teachings, God, in Jesus' mighty name. In agreement right now, we ask you to help them discipline their mind to focus as they respond with ears to hear and a heart to receive when your word is presented to them. We decree and declare that each and every time your word is preached, they will give it their full attention. Yes, we decree and declare that they will concentrate on the word of God and refuse to allow anything to distract them. In Jesus' mighty name, praise you that they will shove all the thoughts aside and they will fixate it on the word in front of them. We thank you because in them renewing their mind, faith is flowing within their life and bringing about manifesting your promises in their life, God. Faith comes by hearing and the hearing of the word of God. As that person I'm praying for fixate their attention on your word, they will see experience supernatural results in their life. Hallelujah. When they walk into situations, the whole atmosphere will change, God. As they step into any life circumstances, they will bring with them the power of your word and create an environment for your supernatural power to explode and impact others so they can heal and deliver, save, and set free. Hallelujah. We believe and receive, we pray, and give you glory in advance. For this prayer is answered. We thank you, God, and we bless you. In the precious, miraculous name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. I thank you for joining me today, and I bless God if you're watching today. Uh, we're preparing um, Thanksgiving uh, to select their recovery programs, and uh, we're looking for um, help. Um, there's a link on the side where um, you can either donate towards the cause uh, within the Warm Coat program, or you can um, just become a member if you're watching right now. Um, you haven't came across this video by chance, it is happening on purpose. And that means it's time for you to start your membership. I thank God for you joining me. And I thank God for you opening your heart and becoming a member and just being to come in an agreement with us in prayer as we continue to move forward as the year is ending and walking into a new year of 2020. May God bless you and may God keep you is my prayer. Shalom.